We back, baby. Yeah. No, for close. Hey, what's the hair? I need a haircut. We back, baby. I figure this could be the last one I record in here. Hey, okay, for the back. As you can see, a lot of boxes being me. It's obvious what's happening. All's coming down slowly. I'm a little bit lazy. Ain't gonna lie, I'm a bit lazy. But that being said, last mail call of this room, I reckon. Anyway, first up, these are all opened. And there's some Christmas presents, actually. But yeah, let's get the first um, mail call. Now, I've taken this guy out of the old hard stack. I was supposed to put something in there, but I never got around to it. So first up, we got the Jack Skellington art series, Nightmare Before Christmas. Obviously, you might have seen on the chat, Dusty, that's how long it's been sitting there. Uh, these all went to ghosts. The reason they're open, first of all, is they all went to ghosts. Shopping them to make sure they're all prime condition. So, uh, yeah, that's why we haven't. Uh, I don't think you can see this. I doubt you'll be able to. Um, like a little, little nick on the inside. I think what's happened, these boxes, the art series, very soft uh, cardboard. So, when it's slid into the hard case, it's uh, just scratching the cardboard off. Um, I don't put anything right now. We put it up there. I don't know if you can see down here, we have got the Zero, same colour. The May has been released, I think, for August. So stick around, we will, will be getting that one. Anyway, next up, let's get this box over here. So, as you know, I say it once, I'll say it 1,500 times, baby. Your boy says, up is his, it's one or two of his favourite Disney Pixar films. I believe it's Disney Pixar, if not just Disney. And when this guy got restocked on Pop in a Box, I was over the moon. But I went to him saying it's damaged, can I get a replacement? Very rare for a company to say this, and they said, keep that, they didn't even tell me to destroy it. They said, we'll send you another one. And I was like, yeah, have it, dab it. Check me my way, baby. So, what we got here, two Carl Pop. So, where's this one do? So the reason I asked for a replacement, put that there. You can see it here, I don't know if high up or low down I gotta go. We got this little, little uh, tear. But to me, it's a huge thing. And the replacement had one as well, which was a bit getting over. But love this pop the detail chuck one there uh this guy he has his grape soda badge as you know which is from uh ellie when they were kids and then he gives to uh russell at the end this the last badge he collects and he obviously goes walker with the tennis balls which doug constantly tries to eat so fantastic fantastic two pops there next up christmas presents uh sister we finally got to see her um two weeks ago in in april all due to COVID lockdown. Anyway, that being said, first up on that list, Joey Wheeler, as you said, baby. We are collecting, collecting the Yu-Gi-Oh pops. A bit rusty in the camera, I'm not gonna lie. Joey, lovely one. This reminds me of the one of the first episodes where there's playing dual monsters on the table in the school, where he ha asks, woo, where he asks, Yugi, can you show me how to play the game? So that one is a nice detail to that one. I think the Yugi Moto, the small one, similar kind of style where they're just holding cards. Next up, we got Doggo Baby. Now, we, you might have seen all my Christmas ones out before. I, I've got a Kab Kablam Man. Uh, I put him there. The reason I'm not really showing um, the box positions because they didn't protect us and they might have, some, might have some glare from the sun, which you won't be able to see the damage. So, yeah, recon reconnaissance style. Like, like, I can say, yeah. This is obviously the 13th Doctor. I think the first time she came in contact with them. The, the government were making, I think, defense programs, something like that? No, that's the Christmas episode. I can't remember exactly, but all rusty. I think that was, I believe that was a look. But as you can see in there, his light's uh, yellow and his eye. And for exterminate is yellow. Beautiful. Last up, little story. No, look. Last up with the Christmas pops. We still got five to go after this. Now, I should quickly show this. We have another Yu-Gi-Oh pop, Yanni Yugi. Last one we needed for the Yu-Gi-Oh set, I do believe, minus the box lunch exclusive Blue Eyes White Dragon. Now that being said, lovely one this is, lovely detail. Uh, I th I can't, I think if this guy had the dual disc launcher, yeah, so put it there, it'd be my favorite. Obviously I say Marek's one is insane detail. This one's really good. It's got the cards in there. It's got his Millennium uh, puzzle. You know, and I'll try and show it from the side. They've tried to put some sort of detail on the card. Nice little smaller detail that. But I don't think you'll be able to see it. Um on the actual box, uh my sister's partner dropped it right in front of my eyes. And yeah, I'll probably see up there. 
Uh, it's hard to see. Little Nick. Broke my heart, man. Absolutely. Now, oh, I've got to show this guy. I've been talking about this guy for a long time on the channel. Finally, we can show off the twit. So, oh, wait, long we've been waiting for this one. 2020 SDCC Alien Remix. Uh, Alien as Kevin. That's this one. Uh, is he flogged? No. Not flogged. Just the uh, up one. we got to get Carl. we got to get them all really right now. But uh, I want to get the SDCC one. Is it the SD? Yeah. Hardest one to get. Lovely little pop. Looks real crazy with the five eyes, but nevertheless, had to pick it up. Next up, another Pokemon one, baby. Don't look too close or too far. I bought this off eBay. Where's it saying? Uh, I bought it. The guy gave me the Squirtle uh, Lounge Fry like keyring. You only got this if you bought the GameStop exclusive Pokemon box where you got the Flock Squirtle and the Flock Pikachu. So the fact you give me that, very nice little touch. So this is one of the many, many variants they've got of Pikachu. We've got Waving, Grumpy, Normal. I think there's a f another one coming up now as well. But this is the flocked Grumpy Pikachu at New York Comic Con 2020. Been sitting on this for a hot minute. Lovely little uh, detail. Nothing more I can really say, which I didn't say on the normal variant, apart from the flock does make uh, Pikachu look a lot better. It does suit him. Like when you look at it, Squirtle, not so much when you look at Pikachu. I think Char Amanda, I don't think the Charmander's tail's ever flogged, but yeah, it does suit it. And let's get into some of the parcels here. We've got two uh, unopened parcels, baby. We know where they're from. Your boy's favourite company. One's a gift for Ghost, one's a gift for me. First up, we've got the, the gift for me. As we know, I, I can't say anything more that I am said about health pops. They've got all these foam noodles in there. I think they're called foam noodles? In a pop protector as well. And bubble wrap. This is a company who cares. We've got the uh, Super Hercule. Now, I believe it's from Dragon Ball Super, but if it's not, no, it's an alternate Earth, isn't it, uh, Hercule? Or is it that, or it's in his dreams where he's a super, uh, super Saiyan? It's in the Ridge case. Really, really do rate the um, protectors. They do send him out. Lovely. He's nothing more about Hercule. He's got a championship belt on. He doesn't, he doesn't have his normal curly hair. They dropped this. I think they dropped on the one day, ordered it, I received it two days later. Fantastic company. Lovely pop. Let's show the gift I got for Ghost. Now she doesn't like me getting pops for her. That being said, I, I told her who it was and what show it was from. She was a fan of it all of a sudden. So, this is when we can show off the box edition. Here we have Dean Winchester. Obviously the Winchester brothers. Sam and Dean, and obviously they Technical brother Castiel. Now we do have a little, let me see this, a little neck. Uh, you've seen the packaging it was in. I can't really complain about that. Little, little ding. Chuck him in a little protector, but he's carrying, is that? I think he's carrying the blade of cane, is he? Or is he just carrying a, a normal knife? Because Sam's going on his one as well. But I thought it'd be a nice touch if they had um, the blade of cane. I can't see the mark anyway. I've watched all 14 seasons, i watched them all in like four weeks. You boys a bit sad, but she does love Supernatural, so I had to get that. And to end, your boy doesn't like long videos. Uh, SG mentioned, you know, your boy's dropping 8 minutes, 40 second videos. I can't talk for that long, man. Last up, he was up here. There's four, maybe five of them up here. This is the last one for the set of Hades. Oh, I've got one more, tell I've got one more pop after this. Okay, let's get this in. Diamond Glitter, or what? Oh, this is it. No, this is the Diamond Chase Hades. Uh, the standard is only his blue and his like really dark blue cape is the glitter. This one, obviously, is the red. There's Hades and his cape. Beautiful pop. Uh, took this off eBay. Had to get off there. I don't think it's as high as the normal one, but obviously, this is a lot newer. I can't even point to him. I can't even point to him. You know your boy collects the uh, Disney line. He collect. He got most of Hercules, which moves us on to the next one. The last one we needed for the set. This is the uh, Hercules writers. Hercules on Pegasus. We did come with a bit, a couple of necks. No, oh, so dusty. Have you seen in there? We got a neck there. I think there was like little little dings. There you go. A little ding on the edge there. But for such a big pop, it was really hard. To get one prime condition, I was constantly offering on different different ones online on eBay. 
and I offered someone I think 50, he wouldn't go lower than for 55, but then someone put him up brand new for like 30, with off I put him off of 28, took it, absolute steal. Couldn't believe my luck on that, so the Hercules set, I believe, is now complete. But yes, I wanted to record this, I didn't want to take too much time, I can't really get back to explain everything, uh, but yeah, that's what we have got. We are all in a bunch of uh, irrelevant to Funko now. Uh, bought one stuff, bought one card, we got a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, I can see that down here, your boy wants to get back and play that. But yeah, that's it. So, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, let me know what you've been getting in your mail calls or even mystery boxes. Subscribe if you're not, if you're new around you. <laughs> the 500 subscriber, as far as I'm away, still going on. I think we're on like 4.31. So we're slowly climbing again, slowly climbing, and until next time, ciao.